Tony Chinqui. Just got a Capital One check worth $8,000. Thanks to that I'll brother that. of yours. Right. <laughs> nice guy helping you out. Wow. Now, Tony, you're going for 16000 and you saved that 50-50, so you have that if you need it. All right. Ready to keep playing? I'm ready to keep playing. Let's do it. All right, let's play. For 16000 Tony, Victoria Harbor lies between the Kulun Peninsula and what bustling Asian city? Seoul, Bangkok, Tokyo, Hong Kong. Here's the deal with Kowloon. <laughs> is that um, the reason I know the name is because it's the name of this delicious restaurant uh, in Massachusetts. Uh, my friend Matt lived in Saugus, and everything's really big in Saugus, so we used to go like, hey, let's go to Kowloon. They serve like lots of Chinese food. So I want you to I want you to hit me with the 50-50. Let's do it. Okay, computer, please randomly take away two of the wrong answers. All right, kids. <laughs> Let's go for Hong Kong. D, final answer. Can't believe you got it from a restaurant in Saugus, but you got it. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Snap, Tony. Snap is right. Meredith, I'm ready for this. <laughs> All right. $25,000. What? What am I doing? All right. You're doing right. good. That's what you're doing. <laughs> and the fourth lifeline. Of what novel did its author famously state, I aimed at the public's heart, and by accident, I hit it in the stomach? The Jungle, Invisible Man, Lolita, Portnoy's Complaint. I may be completely nuts, Meredith, but you live once, you're on Millionaire one time, and I'm pretty sure it's the jungle. A final answer, jungle. Tony, yeah, it's the jungle. <laughs> $25,000 question. Did you really feel in your heart you knew it? or? I felt, you know, I never actually read the book. Mm -hmm. It was one of those, you know, <laughs> you're supposed to read, but I didn't because I was, like, doing other things mm. in college. So, But I got the general gist. Well, you did. So, apparently, yeah. So, <laughs> I'll take that. Either that or your friend Melanie really is bringing you tremendous good luck, right, Mel? Yeah, that's what it is. I think that's at least part of it. What does the, the money mean to you? I mean, <laughs> here's the deal with the money is that med school's really expensive. Yeah. And <laughs> I would love to be able to pay off all these loans, and if I make enough money, be able to pay off the loans for my younger brothers who are in college right now. So oh, that's very nice of you, can, Tony. We can get that going. Keep well, it on the family. Yeah, keep it in the family. We'd love to contribute to that. All right. And so far, you're doing <laughs> great. You just got that 25000 So you have the fourth lifeline, Tony. All right. If you can believe it's happening, it's happening. Barely. <laughs> going for 50000 Are you ready? I'm ready. Okay, let's play. Fifty thousand, Tony. The creation of Adam on the Sistine Chapel ceiling depicts God and Adam almost touching which two of their outstretched hands? God's left and Adam's left. God's left and Adam's right. God's right and Adam's left. God's right and Adam's right. I would guess that Adam, it would be at the right hand of God. But I, I really don't know. So, I'm going to go ahead and switch it out. Okay. Switch well, let's see what the answer was. 
It was, well, the right hand of God is right and Adam's okay. left. Okay, but you know, <laughs> we're done good. with that one. You know, That's all okay. good. We're going to get we're rid of this right question. Uh, computer, please. And let's see another one valued at $50,000. For $50,000. Short for Confederatio Helvetica, the internet domain suffix dot ch is for websites registered in what country? Luxembourg, the Netherlands, Switzerland, Czech Republic. I think I know what it's referring to, but it's really just because of that font that you have in your computer, that Helvetica font. That's the only place I've really seen this word now that I think about it. <laughs> um, dot ch. I got. All right, free guess. Why not? And if I'm wrong, it was pretty sweet. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go with Luxembourg. Hey, final answer. Not Luxembourg. It was Switzerland. But you know what? You have 25. Terrific. Good luck with Med School, Thank Tony. You. And Thank you, you folks, please join us next time. Until then, from New York, everybody, bye-bye.